Welcome back to Destination Playdate. I am your host, a tax log, and this is Taxi Trouble, available on Itch for a price of $4. Link in the description, and it basically asks you the question, what if Crazy Taxi was in a top-down perspective like Grand Theft Auto 1? So, let's find out. This is a high-score arcade-based deal, as you can see on the top of the screen. At my high score currently, 146. I will hit A, it will count down. I am using the D-pad and the A button to drive. Pick up my passenger, and the arrow points me to my destination. B is drift, and also you can kind of hold back, or I'm sorry, down on the D-pad to get you some, you know, breakage. But you go off the screen, and you die, that's game over. And it begins again. So, of course, using that classic formula of, let's make some crazy money! And that whole thing, but in a top-down perspective. Now, where it gets uh, tricky, besides this part here, I'm just, like, failing it. Uh, where it gets tricky is every passenger, as you can see, stays on this map. And so, only people who are blinking are the ones that you're actually having to pick up. So as you get more and more completed passengers on the map, it becomes, all right, can you avoid doing vehicular homicide? Is the big question here. So don't you do it! There it is. Now, what has happened in this, because I added the hats, right? And there are a variety of hats based on your high scores. And now my first hat is the pair of sunglasses. And so it's much easier to differentiate from my passengers and people who are just on the map regular, who have already delivered to their destination. That makes it a little bit easier visually. But again, once you have a lot of guys on the map and you're going too fast, uh, yeah. It's a problem, and people get splatted all over the pavement, and then it's game over. So this is kind of the main game here, which is this. So, obviously, aim for high scores to get more and more things to customize your little guys with, but, uh, see, this is where it gets tricky, because it's like, alright, I have six seconds, and I can get them, but time's gonna expire. I couldn't get there, and ka-splat goes the car. And it reset, and we're back here at the beginning and yeah, so there is an option to play with the crank. Uh, I did not particularly find that easy to play, for me anyway, and I find the D-pad much easier, having played me a whole lot of GTA 1 on the PS1 back in the day. So for me, this is fine, the crank stuff, it's cool that it's there, but I didn't really get the, a good handle on that. Now, also, as you can see here, all my tire skid marks and that blood stays on the map, but there is a button to clean that if you'd like to clean that, so it has to to be there all the time. Here we go. But this does remind me that that other, uh, what is it, Daily Driver's not out yet on the play date, which I did a video on way last year, like way early. Um, it was a demo, and it's not actually out fully yet. I would imagine perhaps in Season 2, maybe? Because it's not out yet, but who can say? I don't know for sure. But certainly when it's out, I'll do a video on that whole bit of business, but here I'm at 106. I would love to get 150. I would love to get 150. Uh, there's a new hat to unlock at 150, so uh, the only hat was up to 1,000, and I'm like, um, how can I ever get 1,000 in this game? Like, that many guys just in the way on the road? No, man, that just seems unreasonable, but hey, I'm sure someone out there is going to do it, uh, but I don't think it's going to be me. So just putting that one out there. We're at 147. We gotta do one more to hit 150. I think we're almost there. Okay, 160. I've hit that. I think next goal is 200. So, again, you go as long as you can. You don't do that. You don't do that. So, having hit that 160, we're gonna hit back to title. You can see here it has crank steer. I can also clean the area. It's all clean. And then the scores locally and the hats. So, 160 high score. I have no hat. I have sunglasses. I have the sombrero. And now I also have the nerdy glasses. So you got two kinds of glasses here, I suppose. And you can see here it goes from 250, 350, all the way up to 1,000 in terms of hat unlockables. But I will show, very briefly, crank-based business. So I'm not sure where to start the crank. It should be started at the top or at the bottom. I really don't know. But there are the controls for the crank. And then we steer. I'm not really sure. Is it? See, I don't know if it starts up or down. I'm gonna start try down. Like, I feel like it's not going the way I want it to go. And that's perhaps just the me problem, but 
Like, it does work, but I just can't do it as well as... See, I'm going all the way around, which is not what you want to do. You want to be on one side or the other. And it's kind of hard to, to figure out which side that's going to be uh, to drive it... Okay, maybe I... Perhaps I got it figured out. But then we go, like, do that, then it becomes, like, confusing. Because then you're all doing this, and... Nah. I'm good. I'm good. So, that is your crank-based steering. And then here are your controls for the regular steering. In any event, this is Taxi Trouble out now on itch. Price is $4. Link in the description. I'm a tax log. Thanks for watching. Keep on cranking. More videos right here on this channel. And I'm out.